Detroit basketball. Detroit Pistons, Piston Mike, Larry O'Brien, it's in sight. Hit that subscribe bell. Don't forget to like it. Detroit Piston, Piston Mike. You know what time it is, you were here for the update. Piston Mike keep you informed, make sure your substrate. So you don't ever go without the info that you need. Let's see the Pistons rise. Detroit basketball! What's good, everybody? It's your boy Pistol Mike. Make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe. Don't cost you anything, not even a nickel or a dime. Let's get into it. Shout out to Alex for always keeping me updated. Make sure you get that shirt in the link in the description. So the Pistons um, traded Kelly Olenek and Saber Lee for Boyan by Donovan. Let's go. I know everybody talking about he's 33 years old, this, that, and the third. Yada. He, he, he's just going on an aspiring contract for $19 million and get this. He averaged 18 points a game, four rebounds, two assists, and shot 38% from the three, 85% at the free throw line. Boy, I'm telling you what, it's about to be a scary sight for a lot of teams. It is very scary. I'm happy Kelly Olenek is gone. He didn't really have a good year for us at all. It was a very, very disappointing year, to to be honest. He was hurt. He didn't really shoot that well from three. Didn't really provide that much for the Pistons. I'm gonna be honest. Saban Lee dominated his D League, took over, but when it come came to the NBA, he had a few good moments here and there, but his jump shot was always funky it was just a matter of time before we moved on from him and this helps us out this helps us out in another way i'm going to talk about that in a separate video but you know this trade definitely helps us i think become more I would not be surprised before I was more like at the 33, 35. I would not be surprised if we make a seventh seed or eighth seed in the East. I think this helps us that much, that good. He's the perfect piece to go right next to Cade, right next to um, Ivy. And then you can put maybe if you want to start Bay and then start Bagley or I don't know, or bring him off the bench. I don't know how necessarily it's going to go, but it's going to be very interesting to see what happens because we got a whole bunch of shooting right now, especially we getting, we're getting all our pretty much K is going to shoot the ball very, uh, very well, I expect. Sadiq, of course, and then you got Alex Burks, and then you got... um. By Donovich, man. So it, it it's gonna be crazy. And if at all, if we are not in the playoff picture by the midway, you might be able to get a, you know what I'm saying, lower tier one or two first round picks for them. Flip them. You know, because a lot of teams are gonna look, a lot of contenders is definitely gonna want them down the line if we're not in that playoff picture. And you can do the same thing with Noel. You can do the same thing with Burke. So, this is going to be a very interesting season. I really can't wait. I'm glad Kelly O is gone. Get that bump up out of here. It was only a matter of time before Saban had to go. Now, this lineup is looking scary. Now, it's got all the potential in the world. Now, it's looking absolutely crazy. I don't think y'all understand how perfect of a fit this is going to be. He ain't much on the defensive end, but you don't really need him with guys like Duran, guys like Noel, who going to block the mess out the paint, guys like Hamadou, guys like Hayes, you know. It's going to be a very, very interesting season. Um. Your boy Pistol Mike, man. Trigger Troy strikes again. Shout out to you, Troy Weaver. We ain't give up no picks, no nothing. They was trying to get the picks from the Lakers. 
And the person says, psych, we about to take this tray. You feel what I'm saying? So, you guys, let me know um, what you feel about this trade, how you think about it, what are your thoughts and your opinions, do you really like it or not. I don't know how you don't like it. I don't know how you don't love it. My my only question is, what's going on with Sadiq Bay? Or are they both going to start together? Them are my only two questions but at a more depth i think we're trying to win this year and that move proved it um it helps us get down for our main roster to like 15 spots so that's another good reason why uh piston fans should be happy about this um so that kimba walker situation really don't matter he will not be here at the starter training camp obviously i'm just so happy um, I'm just so happy, bro. Like, I think, I think we really going to see, um, it's really going to be a great year for the Pistons. I'm ready. I'm excited. I'm excited to see what everybody do. I'm excited for our bench players, for our starting five. I can't wait. And it's only, I think basketball is like, what? We get, we, um, the um the media day is Monday, and then I think after that is the next Monday or next Tuesday. After that, we get to play, so we pretty much two weeks away. I can't wait, but that is all I have. Nah, that's not all I have. I'm gonna do another video talking about why the Kelly Olynyk trade is great for you know who. But like, share, comment, subscribe. Don't cost you anything. Not even a nickel or a dime. It's your boy, Piss and Mike. Make sure you go get that t shirt and link in the description. I'm out. Peace. Let's go. Detroit Border is part of the culture. To deep base, the trade you wanna boast. You know the facts, so why we test the rope? Killing your haze, deadly handles our exposure, cool composure. Team stack to win the chip, act like I ain't told you. First round tick, had him sick. K Cunningham, ass shot you dunking, man. I don't know about y'all, but we come to win. I'm a buzzer grant, they all jumping in. Pissing Mike, we take your flight. Click like and subscribe, we can keep you right. Yeah, it's just the mic.